Are you struggling to use Bootstrap with CSS modules in your project? It can be really frustrating when your styles get scoped unexpectedly. Today, we're going to tackle how to exclude Bootstrap files when CSS modules are enabled. I totally get it. When you enable CSS modules, it can feel like your styles are being hijacked. You're not alone in this. Many developers face this issue when trying to integrate Bootstrap with CSS modules. Here's the specific question we're addressing today. One user asked how to prevent Bootstrap styles from being scoped when using CSS modules. They mentioned that their Bootstrap classes, like the table class, are being transformed into something like app table 19 az Sound familiar? Let's dive into this together. So, what's happening here? When you enable CSS modules, the CSS loader applies scoping to all styles, including those from Bootstrap. This is why your Bootstrap classes are being altered. Understanding this is key to finding a solution. And stick around. I have a great solution at the end that will help you keep your Bootstrap styles intact while using CSS modules. To exclude Bootstrap files from being processed by CSS modules, the user needs to adjust the configuration of the CSS loader in their project. This can be done by adding a specific rule to the Webpack configuration. The user should modify the test condition for the CSS loader to exclude files from the Bootstrap directory. This can be achieved by using a regular expression in the test property. Next, the user should add a separate rule for the Bootstrap files. This rule will ensure that Bootstrap styles are loaded without CSS module scoping. Finally, the user should save the changes to the Webpack configuration and restart the development server. This will apply the new settings and ensure Bootstrap styles are not scoped. Fun fact, Bootstrap was originally created by Twitter developers to help streamline their internal tools. Now it's one of the most popular front-end frameworks out there. Now let's look at the answers provided by other users. An alternative solution to exclude Bootstrap files when using CSS modules is to modify your Webpack configuration you can use the module rule exclude option to prevent Bootstrap's SCSS files from being processed by CSS modules. Let's take a moment to review another user's answer. This user explains that excluding Bootstrap files from CSS modules isn't straightforward. They mentioned that simply using the exclude option won't work because Bootstrap SCSS is imported into a single entry point. Instead, they suggest using the global selector scope which can help but may not fully solve the issue, especially if you're not using post-CSS. That's it for that response. Let's explore another one. An alternative approach suggested by a user involves modifying the import path for Bootstrap CSS. By adding a query to the import statement, you can differentiate Bootstrap styles from your CSS modules. In the Webpack configuration, you can set up rules to handle Bootstrap separately. This includes using one of to specify different loaders based on the resource query. Alternatively, you can exclude Bootstrap CSS from the CSS module processing by using include and exclude options in your Webpack rules. Here's the takeaway. By excluding Bootstrap from CSS modules, you can enjoy the best of both worlds using Bootstrap's powerful styles without the hassle of scoping issues. And there you have it. You should now be able to use Bootstrap alongside CSS modules without any issues. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe for more tips and tricks. And remember, coding is all about solving problems. Keep at it.